We're back at the airport. It's been two years since I've been at the airport. I used to fly literally every month. Every month. And now, nada. Costa Rica, <laughs> which is Raya and Louis's wedding, the travel wedding of the century. Why did I come here to a wedding by myself? Matt didn't want to come. I did not feel comfortable bringing Elliot by myself. So I thought, why don't I just go by myself? And I talked to a lot of mom friends and every single mom told me I should go. Every single mom. It's been nine months of carrying Elliot, eight months of having Elliot, and breastfeeding and pregnancy. It's, it's hard, it's hard. And I've never wanted to like lose myself in this journey of life, <laughs> of, of motherhood and pregnancy. But I've definitely been 100% in it in motherhood this is just for me this is a trip for me so i don't know i don't know i just have like crazy mom guilt and i don't know if i'm doing the right thing i don't even know why i have to justify this to you guys to anybody but i miss him i miss him so much it's my little monkey man and now there's actual monkeys here but he's not my monkey man hmm I'm here to enjoy and to celebrate love and celebrate two really good friends, Ryan Louis, who I've known for <laughs> forever. It's thundering, of course. It's the tropics. I'm dying of heat. It's really hot and sweaty here. But anyways, this is where I am staying. It is a glamping tent here at Zunia, which is like an eco resort right on the beach. Here I am in the jungle alone although technically i have a roommate her name is sorrel you might know her from youtube so we're all here for a week of wedding festivities <laughs> I've not been a very good vlogger this week. Well, it's the end of the week now, and then this is the first time I'm sat down and chat with you since arriving here. Um, I have been doing stories though, but um, I'm okay with that. This week has been so magical, so memorable. Oh my goodness. I did a plethora of activities. There was dance parties every night. <laughs> yoga we did um, a women's circle which was really really awesome and special a breath work session which oh my god I am not even joking you breath work is like just one of the most incredible things you could ever do if you've never done it before I would highly recommend trying it and being very open-minded to it because it is crazy then there were just so many great conversations had at lunch and breakfast and dinner over the most amazing food and I wish I took more photos of it but I'm not a food blogger so like clearly failed there. The ocean is gorgeous, the setting, this tree is amazing like it's just a stunning place so honestly it's just been so nice to just connect and hang out with people that I haven't seen in so long and 
Oh. I feel like I've made peace with my decision of coming here and I'm so happy I took this for myself. I feel like my mom guilt is just like shifted off because after the first two days, I was like really worried how is Elliot gonna do and Elliot was amazing. He did so well. He's just a little rock star, which is a bit bittersweet because obviously I love him and I, I wish that he wish I wish that he missed me more, but I'm also glad that he was doing so well on his own with daddy. Actually, he was not on his own. He was with his dad and my mom, so his grandma and my sister. So like he was being spoiled with all the love. And this has just been such an awesome trip for me. Like such an awesome trip for mama. That's, thank you for following along. I hope you enjoyed this little Costa Rica snippet. Again, I wasn't a vlogger here. I was just a wedding party guest taking in everything I don't know love and friendship <laughs> oh that's my cue time to go it's raining it's raining we gotta put you away protect the camera